Bayern Munich interested in signing David De Gea following Manchester United exit. Bayern Munich are considering a move for former Manchester United goalkeeper David De Gea. Bayern no one Manuel Neuer suffered a broken leg during a skiing accident December and is still to return to action. While the club legend hopes to return to training during pre-season it is expected he will need a couple more months before he is ready to return to action. There are also said to be concerns within the club over what level the 37-year-old will return at after such a serious injury and lengthy layoff. Jan Essoemer was signed in January and served as Bayern's first-choice goalkeeper during the second half of last season but is expected to leave this summer with Inter Milan a likely destination. According to the Times, De Gea is one option under serious consideration at the Allianz Arena. The 32-year-old is currently a free agent after leaving Old Trafford in July, having served as United's no one for 12 years. Andre Anana has since arrived as his long-term replacement with De Gea on the lookout for a new club. Recent reports have suggested he has turned down an offer from Inter worth around pound 83,000 per week with his preference to return to Spain after leaving Atletico Madrid in 2011. Bayern are also weighing up a move for Brentford goalkeeper David Rare with interest in Harry Kane continuing to build. The German champions have already seen two offers rejected by Tottenham for the England international, who is in the final year of his contract in North London. Two of Bayern's top executives have travelled to London for fresh discussions with Spurs chairman Daniel Levi over an £86 million move. Bayern are confident of landing a deal and are not worried about rival interest from Paris Saint-Germain as it is believed that the 29-year-old does not want to join the French club. Eric Ten Hag rates Andre Anana's Manchester United debut in Real Madrid defeat. Eric Ten Hag praised Andre Anana after the new Manchester United goalkeeper showed signs of promise in last night's 2-0 defeat against Real Madrid. The Cameroon international has huge gloves to fill following the departure of David de Gea earlier this summer, but it is to be hoped that his more modern style of goalkeeping will help Ten Hag's side take a major step forward in their development. Anana made several impressive saves against the Spanish giants while he looked comfortable in possession but, understandably at this early stage, there appeared to be issues with communication between the former Interstar and his new teammates. The 27-year-old was left stranded for Jude Bellingham's opening goal with United's defence cut open by one lofted pass from Antonio Rudiger and Ten Hag conceded there were obvious areas that need urgent attention before the start of the new Premier League season. I think good, solid, Ten Hag said of Anana's display. Two very good saves. He was there in the moment the team needed him, so he did his job. I think he integrated well in our team. This is the first game and detail, we have a lot of work to do between him and the defending part, of the team. You could see with the second goal where we are not close at the back post. It can't be that and goals will come there. There are things that are rules we have to follow, and they'll come quick, that we integrate that into our way of play. The main negative on the night was the early injury to Kabi Mainu. The 18-year-old impressed from the start against Arsenal on Saturday and was entrusted from kickoff in Houston, only to end the night on crutches with his left foot in a protective boot. You never can tell straight after a game, so we have to wait for what it is, Ten Hag said. Hopefully he's not too bad, then chances will come. I wanted to see on which levels he could play. Against Arsenal we were pleased with his performance so I wanted to see if he can repeat that some days after. From there on, we set conclusions and now I just have to wait for the diagnosis. Then from there on, we will set conclusions. Manchester United confident of completing Rasmus Hodgelund deal before Premier League season starts. Manchester United remain confident of signing Rasmus Hodgelund, despite Paris Saint-Germain making an opening offer for the Dane. The 20-year-old is Eric Ten Hag's first choice this summer, following tentative talks with Tottenham in which they made it clear they would not sell Harry Kane to a Premier League rival. Hodgelund has already agreed personal terms with United over a five-year deal at Old Trafford, which will include the option of a further 12 months. However, United are working under tight financial fair play constraints and they've already spent £100 million this summer on Andre Anana and Mason Mount. The club's opening offer of £42 million, plus around £8.5 million in add-ons, was rejected by Atalanta.
United are yet to submit a second bid, which has opened up a window of opportunity for Paris Saint-Germain. The Ligue 1 giants must replace Lionel Messi this summer, while Kylie Mbappe is also likely to leave. The French side submitted a bid for Hodge Lund on Thursday but it was rejected, as it was worth less than United's. The Red Devils are seemingly unconcerned by PSG's move, with the BBC saying United are confident of landing Hodgeland before the first game of the season. United take on Wolves at Old Trafford on 14 August. Though Hodgeland doesn't have a long pedigree of scoring goals, Ten Hag feels he can mould the striker into one of the best forwards in Europe. The Denmark international, 6 foot 2, is mobile, strong and fast, though United fans will be concerned that he managed just nine goals last term.